good morning evening afternoon wherever you are if you don't know me my name is taranjit and i'm not a financial advisor it was actually quite sunny when i moved outside in the garden but now it's actually very cold but i'm going to continue with it i'm going to endure it the same exact way i am going to endure this crypto winter today we're going to just have a quick look at the markets then we're going to have a quick discussion about some of the hot news and then finally i'm i'll show you the trading strategy i've been doing which has been very very successful in this bear market the idea is not to earn huge amount of money idea is to make like five ten dollars every now and then that's how simple it is so let's get into it obviously the markets are pretty bloodied at the moment bitcoin is oscillating between 27 to 30 and these are the oscillations that i would like to discuss today ethereum is 1500 at the moment i think it's just sensational generational buying opportunity here i'm gonna pick more ethereum if it ever drops to thousand dollars i'm gonna put a lot of my savings into ethereum these are the times when you should only think blue chips so even for the trading strategy i'll show you what i'm doing with the blue chips but please stay away from altcoins the only alt i have been picking heavily is dot and it is crazy that it's sitting at 790 these are the prices when i first bought dot so i cannot really believe that we are actually down to those prices so again i've been uh, investing quite heavy into dot there's also a lot of fud about binance with sec investigating binance and we'll have a quick discussion about it as well so actually i'm gonna use binance as part of my trading strategy because the oscillations are absolutely beautiful and you'll see that in a second other picks quickly if uh, you haven't seen my previous video avex is is pretty exciting price at the moment with 18 dollars xrp is at 35 cents but when the bull market returns this is the time you position yourself let's move into uh, news quickly so uh do Kwon has denied all the rumors that were circulating uh, against him that he was actually cashing out for last two years the only thing i have taken is the nominal cash salary from tfl the deferred taking most of my founders token because a i didn't need it and b i didn't want it to cause unnecessary finger pointing of he has too much he actually just lost a lot just like people like us so i don't know i am still i, I still have uh, luna classic I have my airdrop, I also have my USDT. As, as I told you, I was actually in India, so I didn't have a chance to react, which is fine. However, the free portfolio is not doing that bad. So remember guys, we were discussing VLaunch. This was a free airdrop and many of my followers got into it. I got around $2,000 worth of airdrop, which I sold immediately. That $2,000 actually I put into Mintrest. So Mintrest has not launched yet, so in a way I was shielded. So my free airdrop is still available and I'll keep you up to date how much Mintrest goes up or down uh, in the near future. So stay tuned for that. But the idea here is let's build up a portfolio which is devoid of any investment from my side. Again, if you want to join on that journey, smash the like button, destroy the like button, hit the bell notification button so that you don't miss the videos when I make them. I might sound crazy here but my goal is to make the free portfolio of $1 million. The last video I made is on Atom Cosmos ecosystem. Cosmos ecosystem don't launch projects the traditional way. They actually, most of the projects airdrop. So please, I will leave a link in the description about that video. So please do watch it. And again, that will be part of my uh, free portfolio where I will not invest a single penny. Join me on this journey. Okay. so. There has been a lot of issues with Binance in terms of SEC investigating Binance ICO, Metaverse crypto assets. Uh, it's actually Binance has made huge amount of money. <laughs> when you make huge amount of money, SEC comes calling for you if you're not their friends like of JP Morgan's and Deloitte and other banks. So this on top of the ongoing bear market makes BNB Binance coin one of the best picks for this bear market again my personal opinion not financial advice however in the short term bitcoin is dropping ethereum is dropping there is some rumors about ethereum merge not going as planned on top of that many many people who deposited into eth striking contract their average eth price was around 2400 dollars so actually that is approximately 40 percent drop from the point where these guys bought ethereum i don't have any ethereum staked so i'm okay all of this means that ethereum might even drop till thousand dollars and that will be one of the generational buying opportunities because i can see ethereum going up to ten thousand dollars once the merge is smooth once ethereum becomes deflationary i can easily see it going to ten thousand dollars okay the last thing i want to talk today obviously bear markets are boring 
you just cannot do much so what i've been doing is is playing with small amounts just you don't need to be a trading expert so here's some oscillations that i have identified let's talk about mathage first so what i've been doing every trade my goal is to make five to ten dollars simple just playing with hundred dollars worth of money no big risk if polygon drops to 30 cents fine i'm okay holding polygon it is a really great crypto to have it has raised millions and millions of dollars it is bear market proof they're going to continue to build anyways let's come back to the strategy so here's here's the lines i have drawn you can draw it wherever way you want but my buying price is every time matich hits 56 cents or 57 cents i buy 100 dollar worth every time it hits 65 cents i sell it and i have done this several times over past a month or so and it has been working beautifully on the last trade uh, I again picked it at around 56 cents, so I think now it's 53 cents, which is fine. As I said, I'm okay to hold. I'm going to keep holding. This is a swing portfolio. It has nothing to do with my long-term hold, which is uh, Polygon, is part of my long-term hold as well. So this is just playing for fun in a bear market. So this same strategy you can do to BNB. So again, it is oscillating for me, for my trades. Whenever it goes to around 280, I buy. And whenever it hits around slightly above 300 i sell that's it that is it and it has been working guys and i'm gonna keep doing it and again i will hold it if it goes to 200 dollars 150 i don't care i can hold it no problem even in the swing portfolio if it goes down i will convert it into a long-term portfolio if they are losses if it hits my above target about 300 dollars i'll sell and i'll take that profit that's all I have to say in this video. Smash the like button and I'll see you in the next video.